Ladies and gentlemen, it's not just the Pentagon under Obama saying NATO and the UN gives them orders to go to war. Congress is not involved. It's not just Obama saying he'll shut down power plants without congressional approval or take guns without a law. That's what they call dictatorship of the bureaucracy. The TSA is telling Congress they will not follow subpoenas and that they are not under congressional oversight when Congress created the TSA in 2001, October. And I guess they think Congress, is, Congress will probably sit there and go along with it because Congress wanted it. Because the foreign banks that took over want us trained that we're prisoners and that we're going to have hands put on us. That's, this is all prisoner induction perp training. This is the biggest TSA news I've ever seen. Look at this. TSA claims it is above congressional oversight. Agency head refuses to appear at transportation hearing. The TSA has refused to attend a House transportation hearing this week with agency head John Pistoli. Ladies and gentlemen, they arrest uh, in the past members of the judiciary and, 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 and members of the executive that don't show up to these. I mean, this is unbelievable. Carl Rove had to run out of the U.S. to avoid one of these. Said he was on a month-long business trip. Remember that five years ago? They just now say, hey, we ain't coming. Remember the attorney general wasn't going to come and then they were going to uh, put him in contempt, so he did? Now the TSA is telling, and you know what, Congress is going to get down and lick their boots probably. The TSA has refused to attend a House transportation hearing this week with agency head John Pistoli personally refusing to appear and declaring that congressional committee has no jurisdiction over the TSA. That is a quote. Man, that is dictatorship. This government is officially illegitimate. Whoa, and you know he's been told that by Obama and by Big Sis. Man, they are going for broke, ladies and gentlemen. Do you realize how much trouble we're in? And the NRA says he's going to come after the guns outside of a law. He's just going to say you're going to turn your semi-autos in. Hey, I ain't turning them in, you criminal scum. And you're not my government. I mean, do people understand this? This is not hyperbole. This is a lawless group of criminals. Congress needs to arrest them all and impeach Obama right now. I'm sick of it. They are, folks, if we put up with this, we'll put up with anything. We're going under dictatorship. The presidency's run by a bunch of foreign banks, and I want my country back right now. I want these tyrants out of here.